Welcome to Center of Light, my dear friends, on a Tuesday night. We're going to get right down to it. Hello, everyone. Let's see who's here quickly. Yak's in the house. Victoria, Natalie, Dana, Jason, Joanne, Kelly Curtis, Carol, Amy Jamison, Ricky Vito, Rena. Hello, everyone. Tonight, my guest is Victoria Smith, and we're talking about how to get your life on track. Let me get my notes. We had some technical issues, so I'm under the gun. I still have under the gun energy. Four Points Spiritual Expo. How to get your life on track through holistic wellness practices. I am going to need your help viewing audience. Because of the technical issues, uh, when I was taking my daily nap... <laughs> We had an electrical storm pass through and I heard a surge. And now the headphones and my microphone don't work. So Victoria is going to come through my stereo speakers. When I do bring her on, I'm going to ask the question. And I'm going to pick one person, say uh, two people. How about Kelly and Amy or Dana? Just someone say everything is fine. My concern is that because I'm not using headphones, I'd want there to be a loop of my voice or her voice. In the system of everything's fine let me know if not we're gonna have to do something about that welcome to center of light let me tell you a little bit about my guest victoria smith <clears throat> and the event we're going to be speaking about tonight which is four point spiritual expo that i am so excited to be a part of literally i am are you ready to transform yourself into the best you have you considered going holistic instead of processed and chemically polluted products in your life? You don't have to live like mountain men to live a holistic lifestyle, you know. If you're considering turning over a new leaf in a life to becoming a better you with the best nutrition, the best environment, and the, clean, the cleanest supplies for the future of our planet then we invite you to the Four Points Expo presented by Victoria Smith, my guest tonight, with V. Smith Media. This event is going to take place September 21st and 22nd, 2019 at the Agra International Center here in Memphis, Tennessee. The Four Points Expo will introduce you to products, lifestyle changes, and the spiritual motivation that will empower you to want to live a cleaner, healthier life. Get educated about paranormal, environment changes, and fuel for the body with presentations for our four hour from our keynote speaker speakers, Larry Flaxman, best selling author, research and philanthropist. Lynette Marie, best-selling author of Few for the Body, Organic Guru and Coach. Dr. Jason Rand, best-selling author of Return of Planet X, researcher and radio host. And I'm going to be a keynote speaker there talking about radical transformation. For both days, is $20 a person. For a single day, it's $15. Why not? Explore the merchants, which includes jewelry, stones, metaphysical supplies, CBD oils, books. There's going to be books everywhere. <laughs> Save you your money. And more. A variety of holistic alternative medicine and spiritual readers, life coaches, and environmentally clean companies looking to improve your life and environment. Included in your admission, you will participate in a participate in up to 15 free one-hour workshops slash lectures presented by our vendors, coaches, and special guests. And you can bet I'm going to have some offers. I'm going to be throwing there as well. Plus for an additional $10, each dabble in the fun of our keynote speaker sessions. The people I just named. I think Dr. Rita is on the roster as a keynote speaker. Unless that's changed, we're going to ask, ask Victoria in a moment. Best-selling author, as I mentioned, Larry Flaxman. He was on History Channel's Ancient Aliens. Also, Discovery Channel's Ghost Lab, discussing paranormal and UFO-related topics. Best-selling author, Few for the Body. As Again, Lynette Marie is going to be there. Organic Guru. I am going to be their keynote speaker. This event is not about stopping by a few vending booths. I love it already. This event is not 
about stopping by a few vendor booths and sitting in on lectures, workshops. You will enter an experience when you come out September 21st and 22nd. The Four Points Expo will have Native American drummers. Oh my God, it's getting even more delicious. Various musicians. I might pull out my guitar. Belly dancers. <coughs> raffles and a variety of entertainment throughout the venue. This experience is about turning the environment around for the future of the planet, our own health, and fueling our bodies with the best nutrients available without the reliance of Western medicine, pharmaceuticals, and chemicals that cause severe medical issues. This is not about propaganda to say, don't vaccinate your children. It's about understanding what has happened to our crops, our supplies, and how we as individuals can, capital let word, choose to live healthy organic lifestyles using the resources made by the earth without chemicals. Then, on the last day of the event, September 22nd at 2 p.m., all your keynote speakers, Larry Flaxman, Lynn Marie, myself, Dr. Jason Rand, uh, again, I'm not sure if Dr. Rita Louise is still on that list, will participate in an open panel discussion about the paranormal, Planet X, and what our mission is for the future of planet Earth over the next generation. Our panelists will include their writings from various books, personal experiences, and spiritual direction given by their guides and counsel. If you still have, if I still have your attention, listen up and you are ready to hear about more, then let's talk about how you, too, can get involved. Tickets go on sale April 1st at fourpointsexpo.com. Workshops will be posted by April 22nd. As a bonus for listening to Center of Light Radio, as a bonus for listening to Center of Light Radio, save up to $5 per person on admission tickets using code capital letters center of light at checkout. A portion of each ticket sold will be donated to Caregivers Wellness Foundation, a 501c3 nonprofit organization in Memphis, Tennessee. That is teaching the community about holistic alternative wellness care through trained practitioners as well as teaching you to use similar methods on your own time. V Smith Media, a global marketing company for organic, holistic business here in Memphis, Tennessee, will also be coordinating various charity fundraisers for other nonprofits leading up to the expo, as well as offerings, as well as offering savings for those of you who want to get you or your business online to share visions missions, teachings, etc. Please be sure to like and follow the Four Points Expo on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter to stay in touch with upcoming events, promos, and more. We're going to try this. Hopefully we don't get a, an echo. Welcome to Center of Light, Victoria Smith. Hello, dear. Hello. You guys hear me? I hear you fine. I, I think I have a workaround. I'll just mute mine when you're talking and hopefully that works. So my people in the audience, let me know if you hear an echo between Victoria and I. So let's, Victoria, let's get right down to it. You have um, something that you see as a way you want to direct this interview, which is totally fine with me, uh, about what you want to bring forth to have our listening audience make it really easy to, for them to say, Yes, I'm yes, going yes. to show up for the fair. Yes, <laughs> yes. We want, we want you there. there. We, want we want you to come experience, experience this experience, experience we're presenting, we're presenting to, you. to you. And we're going and to we're talk, going talk about workshops, workshops and, and the, the uh, speakers, uh, speakers that we're going, that we're going to be holding over the next few days, um, including the keynote speaker panel. So let's uh, let's get right into it. Keith, you want to just go right into it? Yeah, okay. we'll do that. Okay. All right. So um, if you guys are on Facebook, obviously you can't switch over now because you're watching live. So don't do anything right now. But uh, after you're done, go to Four Points Expo on Facebook. 
and of course the website. Um, the website is currently down, just like Keith, I'm having technical difficulties today. So the website is currently down as we are speaking now, but it will be back up in the morning. So just be aware of that. But um, again, you can still use the Center of Light coupon code at checkout to save $5 per ticket per person up to five in, each, um, in, a, in a cart. So you can use it up to five times in one ticket in one session. Um, so we're excited about that. Um, so the workshops that we're going to be doing, let's just get right into it. Um, obviously, the big one is the keynote speaker panel that we're talking about, which is Sunday, um, September 22nd at 2 o'clock, and it will be a two-hour panel. And that does include Dr. Rita Louise. Um, sorry, that uh, script wasn't updated for you, Keith. Dr. Rita Louise is in that. Dr. Jason Rand, uh, Keith Blanchard, of course, uh, Larry Flaxman, and Lynette Marie. Um, all are very well-recognized people in the holistic community as well as the spiritual communities. So these are very good um, guest, pa uh, guest panels that we've got on this docket for this session. They will also be holding individual sessions on Saturday. Um, each will be a one hour session on Saturday. Two of them will be paid sessions. Keith, of course, is a paid session. His is an additional $10 per person that wants to attend and that will hold up to 75 people in his room. And then, of course, the second is Larry Flaxman. Uh, he is also a paid, um, a paid speaker at $10 for that ticket as well on top of your admission. Um, during these sessions, you obviously have opportunities to get your book signed if you've got any of their books. Um, they'll have their books available for purchase, so make sure you're uh, following them on Facebook and on their, all their social channels to make sure you can get copies before the show. If not, they'll have some at the show. Um, other speakers that we've got on the weekend are going to be, and I'm just gonna start kind of on this on the morning sessions on Saturday, because so, they're very important. Um, Saturday morning, we're going to kick off with Joanne Kistler of Breath of Energy Healing. She's going to be talking about um, In My Mother's Eyes. Uh, Joanne Kistler is a local Memphian. Um, she had moved here in 2000 um, from California, and she has been a spiritual worker uh, most of her life, and she went through metaphysical training. So she is actually finishing up her doctorate in metaphysics, and her focus is actually spiritual coaching and helping women get back on track with their energy of their souls of their mother. Um, she uses a technique called Yandi Inner Child Healing. Um, go to her website because you'll learn a lot from this experience because it's, it's a three-day process. So it gets very intense, but you go through a, a very healing process um, like you would through a hypnosis or psychotherapy, but it goes much deeper than that. It goes to your inner child. So if you've never experienced relinquishing your child, she's the one to listen to. Um, I really enjoyed her on my interview uh, a few weeks ago when I interviewed her. I was just really, really lifted by talking with her. What I liked most about talking with her was not just what she said. I could literally feel her connectivity. Yes. Yeah, she's very connected. I, when I met her, it's probably been almost two years now. Um, we actually met at a networking event, and we have just been bonding and connecting ever since. And um she started wanting to do workshops, so we said, let's get this going, and this will be a kickoff of her workshops, but she has done a couple others um, in small in small areas. She's also a yoga instructor, so she uses breath work um, in her teachings as well, so you can connect a lot with her by going to breathofenergiahealing.com, and that is energiaiahealing.com. So please check that out. Um, I'll post those as we go through the, as we go through on the, um, on the links as well. Um, obviously, um, we have two rooms going at the same time on the Saturday. So again, that, that first workshop with Joanne is at 10 a.m. on Saturday. And then at the same time will be Dr. Rhea Louise, who will be doing the secret lives of psychic vampires and attached entities. Um, the way that she describes this is basically, you may wonder what psychic vampires and attached entities have in common. They both want to manipulate you in order to rob you of your life energy force. Join Dr. Rita Louise as she delves into the secret world of the par parasitic beings. Discover what they are, what they want, and why you might want to, uh, why, you, why you might be more susceptible to an attack. So if you've heard of energy of vampires, we all have them. You want to get rid of them. So this is going to, where you're going to learn how to do that. She is very, in, very good at what she does. She's been um, very uh, well recognized across the genre for probably 20 years um, as, uh, yeah, she's a naturopathic physician as well for more than 20 years. And her um, her expertise is in the Institute of Applied Energetics. And she was also a um, radio um, speaker for Just Energy Radio. And she did that for more than 15 years. 
Uh, she's been on several radio programs as well as several um, uh, looks like TED Talks uh, is part of her description. So she's been across the across the board, but she has several books that she can read up on as well. Again, she'll have those available at the, at the expo, but she'll be talking more about just things that are specific to individual people. And Keith, you know Dr. Rita Louise, don't you? Yeah. She is very powerful. I consider her a powerhouse. There, There is no field that she cannot stand in and play in that arena. Even if she's her contenders were experts in that field. She knows n enough about it, not only to carry on a dialogue. She will start intimidating those people who are supposed experts. She's very, very powerful. She's very, very funny. She's very, very sharp. You, you can't slide one neck by her. You just can't do it. That I mean, she's re she is worth the trip alone. And Larry, I seen Larry when I did a spiritual expo in Orlando, Florida last year. He was amazing. Um, but... I love what you're doing with this. You're wanting people not come just for the money to create the next one for the next year. You want people involved. You want them to literally take something away, not necessarily merchandise. Exactly. Yes. Again, it's about the experience. I have gone through this experience and this transition of my lifestyle over the last five years, as we talked about in the last time I was on the show. I mean, it's been a long journey for the last seven years since my father's passing. But in that seven years, I've transformed my life into be a better person a more energetic person and a more involved person um, because of all of the energy work that I've been doing, all of the spiritual healing that I've been doing and, and many other things. So, you know, I want people to experience what I experience. So that's what I want them to enjoy when they come. What do you have um, next here? Yeah. I said, what do you have next for us? All right. All right. All right. Yeah. <laughs> We are going um, into, um, we've got other, um, outside of just the speakers and the metaphysics, we also have some local practitioners. Um, the Cairo Place, which is a new chiropractic facility in Clarville, Tennessee. It's a suburb of Memphis here, if you're not familiar with the area. They're going to talk about how to stay young for your first 100 years. Um, it says, as our lifespans continue to increase, the more and more we feel living into their 90s and many projected to live into the past 100s by the age 20, by age I'm sorry, 100 years of age by 2050, many people's focus in our life is quality. Who wants to live to be 95 but, but without constant pain? Obviously, chiropractic work is um, considered an alternative therapy um, in most cases. So they're going to talk to you about how you can use chiropractic um, medicine as a way to keep your body in shape and how you don't want to deal with pain. Um, Keith, how does that affect you? I mean, I know you're on stage and you're usually working your guitar. So, I mean, do you do any chiropractic work for yourself? As small framed as I am, I often say to some of my bandmates, I am very blessed with being such a small frame person and have an, having an amazing back. I do not have, I muscle, gear, PA system, light trusses, and just moving stuff a lot. And I don't have an issue with my back. I've never injured my back. Every once in a great while, I always take my shoes off. Um, but if I play with my shoes on for a little bit because it's appropriate for, appropriate for the venue, I start feeling a little muscle stuff. But by all means, I love the the practice of chiropractor. I, in fact, an 80 year old chiropractor changed my life many years ago. I had anxiety for two years because I carried drums in the school band and the marching parades from South Louisiana. That my my alignment. I was not aligned in my spine and it was pinching a nerve that would cause me to feel things and I would go into panic attack because I'm worried that it's my heart, my heart, my heart. So I went to this 80-year-old man who said, lay on the table, crack, 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 and he changed my life. <laughs> That's good. That's kind of what my husband experienced. Too. My husband is a martial artist by trade. That's what he does all day, all night. So he has had lots of pain in his lifetime. So I hear you on that one. <laughs> um, and, you know, uh, outside of that, we've also going back into the, we've kind of got it mixed up throughout the both days. So they're not overlapping with the different um, modalities of each people practicing and presenting throughout the day. So we've split it up quite a, quite the best we could. Um, we, of course, can't accommodate everybody, but we're going to do the best we can. So that's at 1130 a.m. on Saturday. Um, and that's going to be in the small workshop room. And they're actually going to have you on the floor and they're going to be doing uh, some yoga poses and things like that. Um, at this um, at the at the circle as well. So that one is a free workshop on Saturday morning at 1130. 
So come on over during your lunch break. You know, it's just right there at the Agri Center. So it'll be a good little break for, you know, the 45 minutes that they're going to be presenting and, and going through this. So just stop on in if you can. Um, following, um, I'm sorry, at the same time on Saturday is another keynote speaker, and it's going to be Dr. Jason Rand, um, who, if you're not familiar with him, he is the author of Planet, Planet X. Um, he has written several books on the um, paranormal experiences, mostly UFO sightings and things like that. Um, he spent his um, his career in the military, and uh, upon you know his exit of the military, he started doing some investigating um, after he left Germany. Um, and you can read a lot about this in his book, um, The Return of Planet X. But um, he'll talk more about that and what the EUTA is. Um, the um, the scientific research says obviously that there is paranormal activity, that there are aliens on Earth, and we work, work uh, walk with them every day. Um, we see a uh, Keith's eyes moving there, so I wonder if he's had any experiences himself. <laughs> Have you, Keith? <laughs> he doesn't want to talk about that one. <laughs> That's another show entirely. Exactly. Yes, my my grandfather used to speak of seeing UFOs up in up in the Pennsylvania, um, in the in the uh, the hills of Pennsylvania. He lived outside Pittsburgh, so he used to see UFOs all the time. He said, but you know, he was a Navy man, so I, I take his word for it. I'm a believer, but I've never seen any. I've never seen an alien sight, but I have seen um, UFOs, so I can I can definitely um, equate to this conversation. Um, but you'll have a special uh, you'll have a special treat there because Dr. Rand is releasing his second book about this topic um, at the expo. So this will be uh, one of his giveaways that he'll be doing and you're gonna get a sneak peek of that book as we present on that um, during his presentation. So look forward to that as well. Um, going in after him is going to be another um, healing modality. Um, is anybody um, familiar with the Dalian method? Keith, are you familiar with the Dalian method of, of healing? You're shaking your head. So I, think that. I know Madeline. that because of... Madeline. Madeline. Thank you. <laughs> She is our speaker on that. Um, she has worked with uh, Madame Not, um, Madden Dalian, um, who is the actual creator of this method. And um, it's an advanced technique of healing the body, mind, and emotions, but is a one-of-a-kind tool to accelerate spiritual awakening. The Dalian method acts as a bridge between the techniques of the awakened masters and you experiencing the truth of these teachings by, for yourself. By using the Dalian method, you can dramatically increase your ability to witness and de disidentify from your thoughts and emotions, deepen your self-awareness, expand your consciousness, strengthen your intuition, improve your relationships, and connect to your inner wisdom and life purpose. Um, I know, Keith, you have been going through a spiritual transformation because I've been watching your your uh, your uh, radical transformation, so I can I know you can attest to this type of work, so I'm excited, I'm excited about, about this, this. Yeah. Um, then we've got Larry Flaxman. We have not set his uh, presentation details as of yet, but we do know that he is doing his second release of his 1111 book. Um, it's going into second production now, as since he is a best-selling author, he's still selling that book like crazy. So we're excited to hear what he's got coming, and uh, we'll keep you up to date with that one. But we don't have any details yet. But he's going to be the um, paid speaker one o'clock on Saturday. Um, following him is um, Isabella Lynette Marie. Um, she's the feel for the body. She's an organic guru. Um, Lynette Marie is a um, brand ambassador for organic organic brands across the world. She is known mostly for pure purity lights. It is a brand um, label that she actually uses on products so they can be um, recognized as, as an organic brand across the country. Just like you have organic USDA, this is just another purity brand. So it is, it's very, very conscious of her going out and working with her team to um, verify that her these products that she's in, in working as an ambassador on, that they are pure and natural. A lot of them are hemp clothing, hemp furniture. You'll see a lot of hemp products um, in a lot of the talks that she does. But Feel for the Body is actually her first book that she released a few years ago. And it's a best-selling book, of course, as well. And she will be talking about um, what types of food are your, is your body going to relate to into increasing the, of course, the feel, as, as it stated. So she'll be talking about the best foods and, and uh, organic foods to use to help feel your body. So I'm excited to hear about that. That's one of the um, first people we have in the area really going into organic foods other than um, Dr. Dr. Watts, who is Dr. Watts Organic here locally in Memphis. She's a, actually a pediatric doctor. So this is a little bit more of an expansion on that. Um, that's at 2.30 on Saturday. 
Um, so Saturday is filled with all of our keynotes for their individual sessions. And then, um, of course, Keith is finishing out the day as the last keynote speaker at four o'clock on that day. And Keith, you want to talk on your on your presentation because you know the best about it. You're doing crossing the bridge to the soul. It's about making people aware practicing your spiritual craft is integral. But my class, my teaching, my presentation, my current life is about putting you in an experience a lot of people who move into the spiritual path understand that it undertakes many years to start seeing some results. So many people don't ever want to brave that mountain. I just don't have the time. It's going to take four or five years for me to start seeing effect. Well, what I have created, put together, is a dialogue, a presentation. It's in fact, in fact who I am. If you're in reaching distance of me, physically, if you're there and I can touch you, I'm going to throw you off the cliff. Or if it's in a presentation like now, it's about bringing you to a state of present awareness so you can experience something here now, not five years down the road, that becomes tangible. And once you get a little taste of it, you go, oh my God, I only had a glimpse of this. And if this is what waits me times infinity, I'm on the path and there's no way I can get off. This is basically the idea of what my presentation is going to be about radical transformation crossing the bridge to the soul. Very good. I'm excited to see. I'm actually bring Keith, can you hear me? Yes. Sorry. Sorry. I'm going to connect for a second. second. Um, okay. So that's good. That's four o'clock. That finishes the keynote speakers for Saturday. Sorry. I have my dog joining us. He likes to be on camera. He's a very, um, very narcissistic dog, as you can see. But this is a gunner. He's actually a. Um, He's actually a very special dog, <laughs> as you can see. But uh, his name is uh, actually Gunner Tripoli of Trail of Tears because he was born in East Tennessee off the Trail of Tears. So that's where he gets his name from, just so y'all can see him. But this is my beagle. Um, and he's actually going to be part of the expo, too, because since we are going to have animal communicators there, um, we would love you to bring your dogs out there for you to get them read um, while you're there. Um, you can bring your pets as long as they are tagged and you can have proof of them having their shots up to date. Just so we have to, we have to regulate that from the Agro Center. But please be aware that we do have an animal communicator that can do readings for you that day as well um, over the weekend. So we're excited about that. So I want to that's, that's you know, fan, That is fantastic. I think that is absolutely out of the box. Spiritual Expo thinking. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. Awesome. That's what I'm here for. <laughs> And then um, as we keep going for the rest of the day, um, on Saturday, uh, um, we have one other person that's going to be doing a, um, she's going to be talking about yoga. Stephanie Congo is a life coach and yoga practitioner here in Memphis as well. Um, she's going to be doing Power of the Subtle Energy Body on Saturday at 2.30. Um, obviously, it speaks for itself, but she is very well known. Um, Stephanie Loves Yoga is her handle on all social channels. You can follow her. Um, she has done a fantastic job over the last five years and making sure she stays relevant in the Memphis community and uh, for the holistic communities as well. So definitely check her out. She's a free workshop and you can come out and experience some yoga before you leave and get balanced before you leave the, the expo on that day. So that's all of Saturday's workshop. So how many of you guys are excited about that? Give us a thumbs up in the in the um, in the Facebook live there for us if you're excited about all those. Awesome. Um, and Keith, on Sunday, um, we still have not finalized the keynote speaker panel. Um, we are going to be getting on with our speakers very soon to get that finalized, but we have to solidify what we're going to talk about because they have all this experience, all this knowledge that they're going to be sharing. And we definitely have to uh, make sure that everybody gets a wealth of information from them and they can walk away knowing where they can go find more and do other things. Um, I think we have another visitor in the room. My dog is kind of looking up at the ceiling um, at Keith, um, at Kevin's paintings. It's kind of funny. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin Chasing Wolf, if you're not familiar with him, Chasing Wolf will be um, at the expo with his art paintings as well. And I know Keith knows him as well. <laughs> um, so going into Sunday, um, Sunday is going to be a more... Um, 
Um, not more of a hands-on, but more of, they're going to be more of lecture experiences, but you're definitely going to walk away with a lot of knowledge. Um, we're going to open up on, I'm sorry, guys, we have one more um, Saturday workshop. Um, while Keith is in the large room, we've got Anastasia Netchery of the Netchery Institute of Memphis. Um, she is also a life coach and a spiritual, uh, spiritual communicator. Um, she has um, written several books, uh, Self-Realization for, for Regular People, No Chanting, Yoga Pants, or Hard Drugs Required is another book. Um, she's a best-selling author as well. Um, she's going to be doing Awakening Your Superpowers. Um, if you aren't familiar with that, you're, you're definitely going to have an earful and you're going to walk away and knowing how you can use your intuition um, in the best ways possible to enlighten your future. Um, that's one of her areas of expertise is helping you move forward in life and leaving all the troubles behind and moving forward. So you'll get a lot from that as well. You will not be bored. You will not be tired. You will not be wanting um, to just walk away. You're going to walk away wanting to make appointments with all these people. You're going to want to walk away, you know, listening to Keith's radio show going forward, listening to more as he converts to Yanni Va, as I see. <laughs> He's going to have to tell us about that in a minute. <laughs> um, but that, that clears out Saturday. So going into Sunday, um, house clearings. How many people have uh, guests in their house, just like I just talked about? I think I have a visitor in my house right now. How many have unexpected guests that they don't necessarily want there? Um, a lot of people have talked about that in my communities that I've been out speaking to people about. And a lot of people have been asking for help on how do I get rid of those negative energies um, outside of what you see on the paranormal TV shows, because obviously they can exaggerate things on some of these television programs and people want to know how to do it on their own. So um, Charlotte Neville, she is Sky River Readings. She is a psychic medium and shamanic worker. Um, she will be talking about house clearings and how you can work with um, your intuition as well as um, other helpers like Sage and things like that. And that's going to be at 10 a.m. on Sunday. Also at 10 a.m. on Sunday is the healing power of resonant frequencies. Keith, you're a musician, so I'm sure you can relate. Uh, Sovegio tones, if you're not familiar with Sovegio tones, we all resonate with them, three, six, and nine. They're the tones of our energy levels, and our chakras actually relate to these tones in our body. So whenever you're listening to meditation, music, and that type of thing, a lot of them will use the Sovegio tones frequencies to help connect your chakras and help you balance your chakras. So um, Lalita Cooper of uh, Sovegio Healing here in Memphis is gonna be talking about the healing power of resonant frequencies. And those again are the uh, Sovegio tones of ancient times. And she'll talk about the history of them as well. Um, so that'll, that'll, be the, that'll be the first sessions. And then we move into some more metaphysical type uh, presentations. Jennifer Ledbetter, um, a lot of people in the Memphis community are familiar with Jennifer Ledbetter. She was, of course, Reiki Memphis for years. She is actually the founder of um, Caregivers Wellness, AKA and New Day Studios, which we are donating a portion of the proceeds of our ticket sales to her foundation to help her grow the um, nonprofit community, teaching people how to use Reiki for themselves and also helping practitioners start their own Reiki practices because Reiki and other healing touch modalities have become a very um, prevalent um, modality in the uh, healing, alternative healing med uh, medicine today. So she is actually helping um, young practitioners get off the ground using her experience over the years and working with other um, experienced doctors and that type of thing in the community. As I said, Dr. Watts, that's actually the vice president of the foundation. But Jennifer Ledbetter will be talking about initiation of the stars. Um, if you aren't familiar with that type of work, um, Jennifer is a student of Patricia Cotta Robles, and I hope I said that correctly because she has several names, but Patricia Cotta Robles is known for eraofpeace.org. That is her website, and Jennifer and her mother and all of her sisters actually trained um, under her several years ago up in upstate New York. Wow, this is new, new news to me. I, really? inter I interviewed Patricia Cota Rubles a few years ago. I've read one of her books many, 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 many years ago. Uh, Heaven on Earth, what, it, what in the World is Going On or something like that. I'm so ecstatic that she's going to be there and I get to meet her. She was actually one of my mentors. Wow. <laughs> I'm not going to want to stay in my booth. I'm going to want to start seeing all these people myself. 
Patricia actually will not be there. I was just mentioning Patricia's name because Jennifer is trained under her. Patricia was actually here in Memphis a few months ago. She did a, an event at Unity Church, and that's the last time she's really made a uh, visit to Memphis. But we can always work to get her here again. That's not a problem <laughs> now that we have the contact. Uh, uh, but and she, also, yeah, yeah. also, while I'm thinking of it, just to let our listening audience know, I will be interviewing the vending booths, the people who run them, the, the keynote speakers. I'm going to have Center of Light going throughout my booth all day long. Just people, just to have you be engaged and a part of it if you cannot get your feet to Memphis, Tennessee. But if you can, as I invited earlier, I play music on Friday. Come out a day earlier, hang out with me. We all wake up in the morning, go get some breakfast. You can buy me breakfast. We go to the event. <laughs> <laughs> We'll have breakfast on site too. We'll have, we're, we're still working on locking down the food truck vendors. We haven't got final confirmation from them. We are working very hard to get uh, raw grills. I'm not sure if everyone's familiar with the raw grills uh, truck uh, here in Memphis, but they have fantastic, fantastic organic food as well as good cleanses that they are promoting now. So they, I'm working very hard to get them here, but they're not locked in just yet. So everybody here, flood raw girls on Facebook and say, come to the four points expo so we can have them there. So you can have the best organic food from Memphis. <laughs> um, so as we go on throughout the day, uh, as I talked about, we have a lot of metaphysical, metaphysical, excuse me. Um, Mary Harvey Gurley, who is now retired from FedEx um, is actually a practitioner of Akashic records. Um, if you aren't familiar with Akashic record, we all carry an Akashic record. We all carry a record. Just like the Bible carries a record, God carries a record, Earth carries an Akashic record. Um, she is now doing Akashic records here in Memphis, and she is going to introduce more people to the actual study of the Akashic records in her presentation, as well as give you offerings of um, getting started with how to get your own Akashic record done through her work. So um, we're looking forward to that. So um, if you want to know more about that, you can just visit uh, Four Points Expo. It's got the details on that. One of my favorite ones that I have on Docket um, is how to use your smartphone as a shamanic tool. Has anybody had this experience? Keith, your eyes are going, hmm, what's this all about? So Lunar Alchemy is a um, practice done by Ms. Pauline Latham. Pauline is a um, writer and has been working in metaphysics for several years. I actually met Pauline probably three years ago um, in a metaphysical group that I used to be part of. and she is very well versed in many things. And if you have not ever balanced your phone or done anything to try to release negative energy, she is definitely the one to listen to. She's going to show each of you that are part of her um, presentation. When you come to her presentation, you're going to learn how to balance your cell phone and use it as a shamanic tool. And this is going to help balance the energies here in Memphis because if you haven't heard, we have 5G trying to come in. Um, 5G is obviously a negative energy because of the cancer um, leadings behind it. And I'm not going to speak the gospel because I don't know all the details, but you'll you'll learn a lot about it at the expo. So I'll let the experts talk on that. But be aware, 5G is not positive. But this uh, using your shamanic your cell phone as a shamanic tool will help you use your cell phone in a positive way to help you stay balanced throughout the day, since we're all stuck on these anyway. <laughs> Um, so you'll learn more about that with Pauline Latham, and you can go to her website, um, lunaralchemy.com. Um, I'll post it on the on the channel here in just a few minutes as well. Um, so that is the 11:30 on Sunday, and then we go into our um, last bit for the day. We have um, Cheryl Yarbrough, who is um, Reiki Memphis as well, and she's done consults by Cheryl. Um, she is a QHHT, that's a, quant a quantum, um, Keith, correct me on this one because I don't know what it all stands for, QHHT, it's hypnosis work that she's a certified uh, trainer in this. Do you know what QHHT stands for? Because I always forget. I don't have my notes in front of me. I anyway, would think anyway, quantum, quantum healing, that would be my best yeah. guess. Uh, I'll look it up here in just a minute, but yeah, so she, um, that's one of her specialties, but she's also a Reiki master as well. She, she does Reiki work, but she is also a, um, a spiritual reader. So she's going to talk with us about the tap on your shoulder and your journey, and it's connecting with your spirit guides and how they will help you along your journey. Um, we all have our counsel, as we talked about in the earlier, in, in the intro that Keith read. 
we all have our counsel and we all have our guides to guide us every day. Um, I have known Cheryl for a few years now and just our brief conversations together, um, she was able to tell me things that I had never shared with anybody that she was getting from my guides um, as we had conversations. So if you are not a believer and you wanna know more, you can definitely come out here and experience this from a lot of the practitioners that are gonna be on site. Um, and, and I'm not trying to toot Keith's horn either, but I know he's been getting into this lately too. So I know he's been doing some spiritual reading. So I'm excited to see what he has to offer as well. And then that last event on the last day goes into um, our Irving Hypnosis is our last um, workshop for the day without the keynote speakers. So Irving Hypnosis obviously is, um, um, Irving Hypnosis is here in Memphis. It's a hypnosis practitioner. He's been doing this for more than 25 years. Um, he works with um, Madra Little, which we all love and respect here in Memphis. Uh, Madra Gale, as we all know on Facebook. Um, she works in his office and she's the one that hosts the um, full moon meditations on full moon weekends as well. But Irving Hypnosis is the one that has welcomed her in, has been very supportive of the community, and he continues to do hypnosis work for all of the people in the community to help open up, you know, things that are, you know, stuck. And as I talk with my hands and uh, <laughs> we continue to learn from him and and uh, what hypnosis can do. So he's going to go into his topic on that. He has not given us the full details of uh, what his specific topic of hypnosis is going to be. So we'll keep you up to date on that as, as we get more information. And then the last, last but not least is our keynote speaker panel, which is Dr. Rita Louise, Dr. Jason Rand, Larry Flaxman, and Keith Blanchard, Yanni Va, um, and Lynette Marie are our five keynote speakers for this event. All, again, fantastic people. We are still getting all the details together, and we are excited to hear what they have to offer and how much we can continue working with them. So, you know, just continue to follow the website, continue to follow us on social media. Um, I'm hoping Keith and I will continue doing these, uh, you know, shows so we can get some of the keynotes on here as well outside of him and uh, just talk more about what we are having coming up. And um, again, it's $15 for the for the single day, $20 for the weekend. That admission does cover up to 16 free workshops and then $10 uh, for the additional two workshops, you know, $10 each, one for Keith and one for Larry's workshop. So, um, bring plenty of spending money because we will, again, we'll have food, we'll have, uh, you know, all the vendors will have jewelry, we'll have paintings, we'll have, you know, uh, readings. Um, we just signed um, Tammy, Ort uh, Tammy Ortiz, who is a tarot reader here in Memphis. Um, she does very, go very good tarot readings. Uh, she does a lot of them online now, but she has been a friend of mine for a few years. And I, I had her at the last metaphysical event we did in 2017. And she has proven to be just top notch. And now that her kids are grown, she's uh, spending more time doing that. So I'm excited to see her out in the community again. Um, and then we'll have Celtic Reiki um, and Madra Gale, who will be doing crystal uh, crystal skull readings as well as shamanic readings there. Uh, I'm sorry, spiritual readings, not shamanic readings. Um, we'll have uh, Kevin Hutchins, who is again, our wonderful Chasing Wolf paintings and artwork. Um, he has really some new artwork that I've just fallen in love with. So I'm, I'm hoping to get my hands on a couple of originals while he's there. Um, and then uh, again, the practitioners that we've got on site are gonna be Miss Joanne Kessler from Breath of Energy of Healing, um, Sky River Readings, who will be doing shamanic readings. We'll also have um, several others and I, I wish I can name them all, but we have over 50 vendors now that we're still bringing more in every day. And we are planning to expand the floor um, because we have additional people coming in from out of town that we're still working out details. So know that the show is still growing. We still have a lot more coming, but we just want to keep you guys aware of everything that's happening and know that we are giving back to the community um, as we do this event as well. Um, Larry Flaxman, who again is our keynote speaker um, and author, he has a nonprofit foundation called the Bridge of Compassion. Um, it is a nonprofit that raises money for the homeless um, in Atlanta, as well as um, Memphis and other communities. Um, I know it's focused out of Atlanta, um, but we want to work with him to help raise money for his foundation so he can help expand that to other communities like Memphis, because we have a huge population of homeless here, especially homeless veterans. And um, Larry obviously is a veteran as well, so I know that's cl close to his heart. From the chat room, Sana asked the question. It is kind of hard to say, Sana, but 
Victoria will have a little better grasp on that than me. She wants to know how much is the average cost for readings? I'm sure it depends on the person, the length of time. Could you maybe give us, Victoria, it's going to be a no less than and a no more than? Or how would you like to answer that? I can tell you that a majority of the people that do readings usually do a dollar a minute. That's kind of the standard practice across the board. They're going to do a discount throughout the expo. You're not going to be spending, you're not going to spend less than 20. You're going to start at $20 minimum and you're going to go through 50 depending on the length of time. So you're probably going to be doing about $20 for a 15 to 20 minute reading and up to 50 for a 30 to 60 minute reading, depending on which practitioners you go to. And that works the same for Reiki sessions as well, because I know Jennifer Ledbetter's booth will have several of her practitioners from a New Day Studios at the booth and they will be doing Reiki sessions as well. Um, so that, that's what you can expect between 20 and 60, depending on the length of time that you look at. Does that answer your question? I'm also going to have some specials. I'm going to be running one that day for those who buy the Divine Principle. I'm going to do a half price full reading session for you. So if you happen to be in the Memphis area or you want to attend this expo September 21st and 22nd at the Agra International Center in Memphis, Tennessee, September 21st, 22nd, come to my booth by the Divine Principle. Remind me of this. I will have flyers about everything that you can have and discounts on as well. So come see me. Perfect. And some of the other specials that I know of that I'm working with vendors on this as well. Um, at last show we did, I spoke a lot about CarUrbanLife.com, CaliforniaUrbanLife.com. Um, we are getting a lot of product from the vendors that he sells of. Um, we'll have a lot of essential oils, a lot of organic foods. Um, several diffusers and things like that. Everybody today is familiar with using essential, as I can see, keep burning his candles back there. So we'll have a lot of that stuff as well. Um, so just know that we'll have a lot of your um, your holistic um, supplies available at the site as well. I know a lot of the local vendors, the Broom Closet, if you're not familiar with the, the Broom Closet in Memphis, they're of course one of our bigger vendors that's gonna be there selling a lot of metaphysical, um, um, a lot of metaphysical supplies. They're also gonna be talking about, of course, um, Haunted Memphis, which is their uh, paranormal investigating team that they do local tours of Memphis um, every weekend. And they're usually sold out. So if you haven't gone to hauntedmemphis.com, please do so because their, their tours are amazing. They get you into some of the facilities that most other people cannot get into. So I'm excited about that. Um, we are still waiting on confirmation um, from Memphis Paranormal, uh, Memphis Ghost Hunters, excuse me, Memphis Ghost Hunters was one of the people that I reached out to because we had other people wanted to know about paranormal. And I know um, Larry, as well as the team from the Broom Closet work with Paranormal Investigating. So we want to have more of that involvement as well. So we'll keep you posted on that as we get closer to the event. Um, that's really, I mean, that's kind of what we wanted to talk about tonight. As we get closer to the event, we'll continue sharing more with you, but we're, we're both stoked. I know Keith. Um, and I know, and I hope you are going to get your guitar out. <laughs> I had the opportunity to spend time with the holy man who is my Lord at this day in the age of my life, Swamji Viswayogi. He's in town that week and there's a major event surrounding his presence. And I decided to be a part of the fair. <laughs> and if you knew me and how much I love me some Swamji, <laughs> well, maybe we can get into the fair. <laughs> I mean, he's, he's, he's obviously involved with the physical, right? <laughs> Remind me of that again, because he will be in town, and I will, and we can make this. Wow. Mm -hmm. Maybe no, we'll, we'll tell. We want to get, bring people. I will. I will get on this first thing tomorrow. Remind me. He may, I would be willing to put my, whatever it takes to get him to speak. This would be freaking awesome. Yeah. yeah. And again, and again you know, we're going to have other entertainment. I mean, we have all the workshops happening, but we will have other entertainment throughout the day. A lot of it's still in the works. We haven't finalized all the details, but we did mention the highlights, which is the belly dancers, the drummers. We're, we're working with several organizations to get them out. And, you know, we want to support them as much as we can. Um, we are, you know, we are such such a big event that we have to kind of, you know, pick and choose which ones are going to be the most beneficial. But my most important thing is I want to have the Native American drummers because that's obviously a big part of the shamanic work that we do. And obviously um, having some of the dancers and things like that that are a big part of, you know, the chanting and, and that type of work. So 
those are my, my main focuses. Um, you know, there are other, you know, organizations in town that I would love to, you know, bring in as we get closer and then, you know, cross promote, but it's, a, it's about sharing the community. It's not about us making money. It's about making the community known, people getting in there, getting familiar with it, knowing about the organizations that are doing different types of events, the businesses as well that are, you know, doing readings and that type of thing. It changed my life. It's going to change your life. And the more you get involved with, you know, healing yourself and hearing your healing, your mind, body and soul, as we always say, the better you're going to be for the future. So that's what I want everybody to experience when they come in. Victoria, any final addresses, hyperlinks, web addresses you want to impart before we say goodnight? The most important one is fourpointsexpo.com. And that's spelled out F-O-U-R-P-O-I-N-T-S expo, E-X-P-O dot com. That gets you to all the information. It's also available on Eventbrite. Um, all the discounted tickets are available on, on the direct website, Four Points Expo. So don't go to Eventbrite to try and get discounted tickets, but they are available through both channels, Eventbrite and fourpointsexpo.com. Our um, vendors that are um, are supporting us are also posting it on their, po on their channels yeah. as well. So just look for them, support them because they are getting a portion of ticket sales whenever they sell them. So don't, don't be stingy and think you have to come directly to us. We want to support the community and, and share the wealth um, as we grow. So fourpointsexpo.com and use center of light coupon code at checkout to say $5 per ticket up to five per, per person and register today. So if you also go to four points expo between now and July 31st, you can uh, register to win for a free weekend pass. So we're going to be giving five of those away every month. So June and July, we're going to be given a, a total of 10 weekend passes away. So make sure you register on the website when it comes back up tomorrow and um, we'll get you going on that. So we're excited. Fourpointsexpo.com. Thank you, Victoria. See you soon. Keep us posted on what will happen. We'll set up another date real soon and we'll keep everybody informed of what's happening for Four Points. Cool? Awesome. Everyone, Victoria Smith, we were talking about Get Your Life on Track, Four Points Spiritual Expo that is going to take place September 21st and 22nd. I'm wondering why my music's not engaging. I got, because it's not my music. Oh my God, I got to have my music. Here we go. <laughs> See you all very soon. Just a little later tonight, I am going to be doing a presentation on Knee Deep in the Hoopla Downloads 144 Ascension, 5D, Where's My Prayer Warriors, Soulmates. I'll see you in about an hour. Peace, love, and remember, always live in the blessed light of what you are when you stand in your power, and that's when you stand in your love. What you are, what you do, you obliterate you.